Hey everyone, welcome to a special video. Today I'm going to be showing you how to get iOS 8 on your iPod Touch 5th generation. This is 100% real, it's not fake at all. Uh, this is my first video doing something like this. So, I thought, you know, people want to get iOS 8 early. I thought I'd make a video on it. So, just for proof that this is not fake in any way, I'm just going to slide to unlock my iPod. You can see that we actually have the uh, wallpaper that you get in iOS 8. And if we go into settings here, you can see that this is 8.0. This is the Gold Master Edition, so this is the final version as well. Uh, but Apple might release another version of it. But if you're just going to get this version, you're pretty much up to date. So I'm going to hop on my computer and show you exactly how to get iOS 8 on your iPod Touch 5th generation and we'll go from there. Okay, so now that we're at the computer, we can actually install iOS 8. So, this is the iOS 8 Goldmaster Edition, so the person who hacked this owns all the rights to it. I don't, all I did was find it. So, first thing you're going to need is you're going to need WinRAR. Or, of course, if you want to use 7-Zip, you can do use that as well. So, I will have WinRAR in the description below for the link. And just click that, and it will take you to the page like this. And click on your version. If your version is English 64-bit, click on that and download it. If you're English 32-bit, click on that and download it. So, yeah. Once you've installed WinRAR, then click on the next link which is of course the iOS 8 Goldmaster Seed for the iPod Touch 5th generation now mine's frozen at the moment so I have to show you what happens this page is getting a lot of heavy users on it so this is what it will take you to okay simply just go download to your computer this is going to take a really long time to download but it depends of course how fast your internet is and of course, if you want the iPhone or iPad versions, I will put the link in the description below. I'll actually try and find those. And basically, installing iOS 8 on them works the same way as it does on installing it on the iPod Touch 5th generation. So, yes. Luckily, I've already done that in advance, so I'm just going to pretty much stop that and go into where I found it. So... First of all, you're going to find your iOS 8 Goldmaster Seed uh, for your iPod Touch 5th generation, of course. And you're going to find it, and you're going to right-click, and you're going to go Extract Here. Done. You simply drag your file to the desktop. I've already done it. And then we're going to go into iTunes. And, of course, we're going to make sure that we're up to date to do this. going to click on Help, and you're going to go about iTunes. If you're running on iTunes 11.4.0.18, you're up to date. If you're not, click on help again and go for check for updates and then update to the newest version. Once you've done that, connect your iPod Touch 5th generation in, get it connected, and then you definitely want to make sure that you've backed up your apps and files and that. Of course, I would definitely recommend you back it up to your computer. But, of course, if you want, you could probably use iCloud, but computer is probably a better way to go. So, once you're backed up, then you can update to iOS 8. To do this, you simply want to hold down Shift if you're on Windows, and if you're on a Mac, then hold down Control, and click on Restore, iPod. Uh, simply find your folder, so click on desktop if that's where you've extracted or put your file to and then you just want to open that you're going to click on restore and go open and then you're just going to click restore now I've already done that so I don't need to do that it will update you from either iOS 6 or if you're on iOS 7 it will update you straight to iOS 8 and pretty much follow what it says from there it won't take that long but just extracting it and putting it onto your iPod will take a bit of time then you can either choose if you want a clean install so if you want nothing on it and just want fresh clean iOS 8 
But if you want to restore your backup, then you certainly want to click on Restore Backup. That will take a long time. So, yes. Since I've already done that, you're pretty much done. And you'll be pretty much jumping up and down because you have iOS 8 on your iPod Touch early. Yes. Of course, definitely give this a thumbs up. A lovely like would definitely be appreciated. And of course, if you're stuck and you need some help on how to get iOS 8, put a comment down below. I will definitely respond. And of course, definitely subscribe to my channel if you want any more exclusives or first looks. Because I will certainly be doing that. I might even show you later on, like I did for iOS 8, on how to show you how to get iOS 9. And there will be a lot more from there. So yes, if you even love gaming playthroughs, I will have a lot of that too. So yes that's that that's how you get iOS 8 on your iPod Touch 5th generation so thank you all for watching I'm JSB and I will check you all later for another video peace